Welcome to the Modular Clubhouse. My name is Jesper and today I want to look at polygonal VCOs. And for those of you who have seen the ERM Polygogo, they you know exactly what I'm talking about. Uh, but what people might not know is that you can also do polygonal uh, oscillators on the Bafaco Lich. And I think it's a few weeks ago that a team from both well, Bafaco and Rebel Technologies came together and uh, released this polygonal VCO that you can load to your uh, Bafaco Lich as well. So without further ado, let's uh, dive right in. So on the one hand, you've got the documentation here that comes uh, on the Rebel Technology website. I would strongly recommend everyone to uh, read through that. And they also reference some scientific papers uh, which, okay, well, read them if you must. I enjoyed reading them, but I've got a, a background in physics, so I enjoy reading scientific documents and scientific papers, and I like to understand things. Uh, it is quite technical. You need to know your math if you want to understand this, uh, but if you um, have a few minutes, read through them, and you'll understand a bit more of what's uh, actually happening behind the scenes. Uh, but what I will recommend everyone to do uh, is if you've got the polygonal VCO loaded on your Bifaco Lich, open up an oscilloscope. Uh, I'm right now I'm using, of course, VCV rack for that and visualize the actual polygonal uh, shapes that you are creating with your Bifaco Lich. So as you can see, I've just uh, opened up VCV rack, took my audio interface, connected both outputs to that because one is of course for horizontal and the other is for vertical so that's why you need the x and uh, y coordinates for both of them and you can then of course start playing around with it so as you can hear it doesn't really matter if you're running this in a single uh, frequency or if you're running this in uh, in a melody like I'm doing right now so you can actually just uh, start turning around you can oh, increase the pitch and you see funny things happening together there but it really starts to be more fun when you start adding additional polygons to it so you start off with a triangle you go to a square pentagon hexagon and you can keep keep on going keep on going the other thing you'll see is that the actual wave shapes that you can see on the right hand side, they will also well, evolve there as well. So if you've got them like this. And the other thing, you can give them teeth as well. So let's call that ring modulation on steroids. Or is it FM on steroids? I'm not quite sure. But I like it. And you can do so much more. more complex shapes beautiful isn't it so if you want to do the exact same thing uh, what you'll need is you'll need to have your uh, Bifaco Lich loaded with the polygonal VCO. Um, you'll need to have an audio interface uh, with at least two inputs. So you can have both the left and right outputs for the X and Y. And you're going to need VCV rack with an XY enabled oscill oscilloscope. Um, so just look for that in the plugins and you'll find it. And um, I would say, well, go and have fun. There is so much more to the uh, polygonal VCO. They've, if they've got full menus underneath the actual buttons. So um, give those a try as well. 
And I would say for now, hope you enjoyed this. Stay healthy, stay safe, and talk to you soon. Cheers. Cheers.